Tired of spending hours on hard lead code questions? Meet Jobot, the chat GPT powered assistant. Today we are challenging Jobot to help us understand and solve a hard level lead code questions. The problem that we are solving today is called median of two sorted arrays. The problem is a difficult level problem and it states given two sorted arrays nums1 and nums2 of size m and n respectively return the median of two sorted arrays. The overall runtime complexity should be O of log m plus n. This last statement makes the problem difficult. So today Jobot will explain the solution. So first we'll head on to jovian.com and on the bottom right corner we will find Jobot powered by ChatGPT. We'll extend it and I'll paste the question and some sample input output here. I've already created a prompt with it so I'll paste it. If you want to watch the prompt you can just pause the video and read it. But yeah, with that, I'll provide this and Jobot will provide me the solution for this and it should not provide me the code directly. It should only give the solution. So this is the solution that Jobot has provided us and there are two solution. In the first solution, it says we can use two pointers approach to merge the two sorted arrays into a single array and then obviously find the median out of it. But this approach will take a time complexity of big O of m plus n that is linear time complexity. So we are not interested about this approach. There is another approach that Jobot mentions which will take log of m plus n time complexity. So there are two arrays nums1 and nums2. We are considering the nums1 as the first array and nums2 as the second array. And now we are changing the partition to make both the arrays of equal length. And the first element of the second array will be greater then the last element of the first array in sorted order. So if we arrange the arrays in that order, then we can easily find the median by finding the average of the last element of the first array and the first element of the last array. That is what is mentioned in this solution. Now you can try to go through the solution more thoroughly and understand it. But let's move ahead with the code. So I'll ask to provide the code in Python and let's see what it gives. Okay, so there is a note at the end of the code that mentions that nums1 and nums2 are sorted and are of list types. So now I'll copy the code from here and paste it in the lead code. So let me do that and I'll run the code and let's see if the solution that is provided is correct or not. And it seems it's passing the sample inputs and outputs. I'll submit it now. And cool that passes it and we are getting a very good solution also. So this way you can easily solve lead code questions using Jobot. Now one thing to note here when you are taking help from Jobot to solve your lead code questions. Please try to write your own code before directly taking the code from Jobot. Once you get the solution try to type out the code by yourself. And at the end if you are unable to solve the question by yourself then you can ask for the code from Jobot. This will help you a lot in your learning and this works like a personal assistant for you. That was the video. Now how I wrote that prompt if you want to know more about it. Let me know in the comments and I will create a video about it. Make sure to like and share our video for more such amazing content on AI and tech and do subscribe the channel. Thank you and see you on another video.